Okay, back in the ski shop, and what I want to talk about is machine tuned edges versus hand tuned edges. So this this ski is an old used ski, and it has been machine tuned, and you can see all the striations or the lines that are going up and down that edge. And that's what the ceramic disc or the disc wheels do to these edges. And some people are going to tell you that maybe all those striations act like a serrated knife or something. I don't know, on the base edge they may, may claim it's like a, it acts like a structure in a ski. But uh, saving grace for this pair was whoever had them they did not uh, tune the base edge anymore thank goodness because they would have destroyed it but okay so this is the machine tuned edge and you see the striations carry on all the way down we're going to run down here okay we're going to run down here real quick okay anyway these and that's what you get oh, i'm getting some shaded anyway that's what you get from that ceramic disc so, some better than others, okay, but when you come down to this end, you should be able to see where the disc leaves, and then it doesn't tie in anymore to the rest of the ski. Oh, trying to get keep my focus there. Anyway, okay, so now I'm going to show you here a uh, ski here with a hand-tuned edge, and let's, let's look at the difference. Let's... See if I can get this camera in a position to... Okay, this is a hand-tuned edge. Now, you're not going to see the striations. See? The lines that you do see on it are going the way that it runs through the snow, like a linear grind, if there is anything in it. Anyway, I'm, I'm not doing too good on, on my camera here. Let me, let me try a di little different angle. Okay. Okay, so here is the, oh dang, too much shadow, okay, hang on here, okay, there is the hand tuned edge, okay, and this one's all dirty, I haven't even buffed it off with a, if I buffed it off, doggone it, it would look better, but there you go, okay, look at it reflect, okay, that'll tell you one thing right there, okay, look at that. Okay, that's a hand-tuned edge, and then we're looking at a side edge right now. Okay, now we're going to bump back up and look at this machine-tuned edge. Okay. Okay, here we go. Look at that. Well, I uh, still having a hard time. Anyway, you saw it, okay. I'm just getting all the doggone work. There you go. Look at that. I gotta hold it at just the right distance because I set the focus on it. So anyway, there's the the difference. Well, actually, what I wanted to say about this type of a edge tune or base tune is it creates a warbly edge. It may be sharp as far as like yeah, it'll grab some of your nail, but she going up and down and up and down and up and down and it is not like having that type of a tune that does not go up and down and up and down and up and down and that is true so that's what you want to do